Yes, well, I'll go and see him tonight, Cathy, with you and Pete. He wants to see you today. This morning, preferably. Look, this place ain't gonna run itself, you know. I don't think he'd appreciate me closing it down. Well, I can come in for a couple of hours. No, you've got your store to run. Cindy, he wants to see you this morning. I can look after the calf. Look, what difference is a few hours gonna make? I know he gets fed up in that look, hospital, but... Look, he started to remember things. What things? The night of the accident. He started to come back to him. How do you know? He told me last night. And how much is he starting to remember? He didn't say. And that's what you want to see me about, is it? Right. So I'll look after the calf then, shall I? Yeah, thanks. Morning. You got a queue for me outside, Cindy? Excuse me. Hello, Kath. There's nothing. There's nobody there. They've all gone. I don't know. There's nobody there. It must have something to do with me seeing Mr. Kent yesterday. Maybe it worked. Maybe. Well, it must have done. The wires will just disappear overnight. How do we know they won't come back tomorrow? Well, we don't, do we? Well, that's it. We don't. We just don't trust them. No, I know what you mean, then. Well, it's not the first time they play silly beggars, is it? Good morning. Morning. I mean, say they have pulled out. Say we have one. I mean, it's grown hurt from them, have we? Hang on. Maybe I should phone them. That's a good idea. But I'll do it. I'll be glad to. That time somebody told him what's going on. I seem to have lost them. I lost you, lost your sister. You ain't seen her in a while. No, I haven't. Well, you'll have to do it in the sun. You know what it's all about. Oh, Dad, 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 I've got to go. Run away, please. Well, I might as well have a cup of tea while I'm here, love. I'll cut me get it for you, Frank. Right. It's engaged. Well, I'm off now. Uh, Cindy, give him my love, would you? Yeah. Oh, and uh, be careful what you say to him, eh? I don't want him upset. Yeah. Any, uh... Charles of a cup of tea, Nick. Sorry. Let me see you in here, Mum. It's a free country, isn't it? Yeah, but I mean, I'm paying for my stuff, ain't I? Yeah, I know. I'm just saying. Like... There's something when a body can't sit and have a bun and a cup of tea without being bullied along. Hey, bully no one, Mum. I'm just saying you sit there as long as you like. I can't even get a bit of peace and quiet when I'm minding my own business. I'm not trying to pass the time of day. As if I don't have enough to put up with with Pat and Frank whispering in corners all no, morning. I wish I hadn't bothered there. Cindy, here you are. Why well, I'm not late, am I? Oh, don't you start. Just had a mouthful from her. Look, how was he? All right. Well, what happened? Did he talk about the accident? No. Look, Cathy, I don't know why I told you his memory was coming back, because he told me he don't remember a thing. Big and butch you've grown. You're still my little boy. It's hard to let go completely. Yeah, do you think I'll feel the same about Stevie when he's grown up? Well, I don't know. It's probably just me being yeah. stupid. Yeah. How did the Cindy sing when she got back to the calf? Fine. A bit tired, perhaps. Well, you know we were arguing, arguing the uh, night of this accident. Well, Cindy told me something then, right? She told me she'd done something stupid a long time ago. Well, I told her then, and I told her again today, right? But what's done is done. I mean, it's all water under the bridge as far as I'm concerned. I mean, what's important is to put it behind us, eh? And look to the future. I mean, I'm prepared to do that, and I mean, so is she. I mean, what's important is just to get on with it. I mean, look, we all make mistakes, don't we? I mean, look at me. I'm always too busy earning money in the calf. I mean, Mum, we owe it to Stevie, you know? We owe it to the little boy. I mean, he doesn't want a mum and dad who are going to spend the rest of their lives looking behind them, does he? So you reckon you got it straight, then? Oh, definitely. I mean, me and Cindy, I mean, we are looking at the future now. I mean, just as soon as I get out of this place, I'll tell you, everything is going to be great. I mean, it's going to be really great. 